My name is Jason Castle. I'm a biologist here at GE Global Research. Recently, uh, our emergency response teams got the opportunity to go through New York State certification of EMT. And uh, a year and a half or so ago became EMTs. A number of us serve on outside agencies. One of the most important parts of uh, EMT emergency medicine is supplying oxygen as quickly to as possible to a patient. Uh, there's, especially in the case of a heart attack, uh, it's called the golden hour. The sooner you can get definitive care on that patient, the better. Uh, essentially what a heart attack is, is a blockage of the blood flow, so you're cutting off the oxygen supply to the tissue. If a call were to go out for uh, chest pain or some similar uh, response, for a rural setting, you're talking from the point of the call, perhaps up to 30 minutes just to get to the hospital. From the time of dialing 911 to stent placement, definitive care, uh, it could be up to several hours. Researchers today are working on ways to reduce the amount of time it takes to get to definitive care. And one of those is with contrast enhanced ultrasound. And couple that with the portability of an ultrasound system, emergency medicine will move from the ER to the back of an ambulance. Uh, with contrast enhanced ultrasound, visualization has improved in the heart. Uh, emergency care providers will be able to begin diagnosing as well as treating in the ambulance long before arriving at the hospital. Using the contrast agent, it's like turning the light on. You can now see clear delineation of the whole left ventricle, wall motion and function, and get a much clearer image of what's happening with the heart. So being a biologist, you see the uh, emerging technology and the capability and potential of this new technology. But then being an EMT, you see the unmet needs and the tremendous potential for improving patient care. And working in this field, you can combine those and move that patient care from the ER to the back of an ambulance, and that could have tremendous potential, uh, saving lives as well as improving patient outcome.